He woke up in the cold room, just as he had done so many days before. The room looked like a hospital room, but that's what you'd expect in a retirement home such as this one. He got up, swinging his legs to the ground where his slippers were poised, waiting for him. His roommate was still alive. So was everyone else. The nurses were bringing trays of food to the patients who couldn't leave their beds. They did this every morning at 6.45. He walked down the hall to get a copy of the paper. The news looked the same. He went back to his room and sat down in his bed. Everything was the same. And he was surprised.